wamekuwa wengi wengi sasa na tunaelewa ya kwamba wanafurushwa pande wengine because of what's happening across the border in Somalia na kwa sababu ya mvua pia because during rainy season ndio hao watu wanapata fursa ya kutembea na kujificha tukiwa serikali at both levels national na county tutashirikiana kuhakikisha ya kwamba we stabilize the region we stabilize the county and we bring security under control na al shabab the manner of operation is such that you can't really defeat them without the help of the locals and this is why we had a very good meeting with all the key elders of this county picked from all the six constituencies so that we can deliberate on the way forward and we made it very clear to our people if we do not get rid of al shabab in our midst today from within our midst they might turn into they might turn us into the boko haram situation in northern nigeria and we will not wait for that to happen we need our schools to be open we need our health facilities to be accessible to our people we need our roads to be passable we are already fighting from behind we are struggling in keeping pace with the rest of kenya because of legacy issues hatutaki kustagnate kimaendeleo kwa sababu ya alshabab ndipo sababu tumechukua kauli kwa kauli moja hivi leo msimamo mmoja ya kuhakikisha ya kwamba at both levels of government tushirikiane na locals kuangamiza alshabab from within wajia county from within the northern region and from within kenya inshallah